On the far edges of the Palawan archipelago, hidden away from the world, lies Kauri Island, a place of breathtaking beauty and peace, where the crystal clear waters kiss the powdery shores and the wind whispers stories of ancient times. For generations, this island has been a sanctuary, both for those who dwell here and for the creatures of the sea. But Kauri Island is not just a place of paradise, it holds a secret as old as the ocean itself. A legend passed down through the island's elders of a powerful guardian of the sea. They speak of the king of the Kauri snails, a majestic being who ruled the waters and ensured balance between land and sea. Kylan, a brave young boy, and Lyra, a curious and kind-hearted girl, grew up hearing stories of the king of the Kauri snails. They dreamed of finding him, of restoring the lost harmony, but no one had ever dared to search for him until now. A storm unlike any other struck Kauri Island. The waves rose higher, the winds howled louder, and the island itself seemed to tremble. The elders whispered that the sea was angry, that the king of the Kauri snails had turned his back on the island. Only Kailan and Lyra believed they could change the fate of their home. With the storm's fury still raging, they made a vow to journey into the depths of the sea and find the mythical king. Their adventure began at dawn, as the first rays of sunlight pierced the stormy clouds. Their journey took them to the farthest edges of the island where ancient maps hinted at the entrance to the underwater world. A journey full of danger, mystery, and hope awaited them. Beyond the shore, under the vast expanse of the ocean, Kailan and Lyra were faced with their first trial. The waters were dark and treacherous, and the path ahead was uncertain. They dove deep into the unknown, guided only by the stories of old. The sea seemed alive, with creatures both strange and beautiful. Kauri snails, small and shimmering, began to appear along their path. It was a sign they were on the right track. In the depths, they discovered an ancient shell gate said to have been built by the first islanders. Beyond this gate, it was said, lay the lair of the king of the Kauri snails. But the gate would only open for those with pure hearts. The deeper they ventured, the darker the ocean became. Kailan and Lyra could feel the weight of the water pressing in on them, the cold creeping into their bones. But they pressed on driven by a force they could not fully explain, an ancient pull that seemed to guide their every stroke. For hours, they swam, following the delicate glow of the cowrie snails. But as the waters grew deeper and the light began to fade, doubt crept into their hearts. Was the legend of the Kauri King just a story? Could they really find him in the endless depths of the ocean? Lyra's heart wavered as the silence of the deep ocean pressed in on them, the soft trail of snails that had once seemed so certain now flickered like a distant memory. Are we too late? She wondered. Has the king truly abandoned us? But Kailan, with every ounce of strength he had left, refused to give up. He had heard the story since he was a boy, tales of the king's majesty, of the way the sea once bowed to his will. Kailan knew, if they turned back now, the island would never be the same. He could not let the king's legacy die with a whisper. And then, the ocean itself seemed to awaken. A powerful current surged from below, pulling them into a vast trench. The ocean, once calm and mysterious, now roared with fury as if testing their resolve. The water churned and twisted around them, threatening to tear them apart. Together they fought the pull of the deep, clinging to each other, determined not to be separated. 
Lyra's grip tightened around Kylon's wrist as they were drawn into the darkness, where no light could follow. And then, as suddenly as it began, the current stilled. They had reached the bottom of the ocean, where the weight of the water was so thick that even time itself seemed to pause. The darkness was total and the silence deafening. But something was there. Something waiting. A faint shimmer, like the first light of dawn breaking through the darkest night. Kylan's heart pounded in his chest as he swam forward, pulling Lyra with him. Slowly, the shimmer grew brighter, revealing the outline of something immense, something ancient. The light pulsed in time with the beating of their hearts, casting an eerie glow on the vast underwater cavern ahead. Kylon and Lyra felt it. The presence they had been seeking all along. They had found him. The king of the Kauri snails. Larger than any creature they had ever seen, his shell shimmered with the light of a thousand stars, casting rainbows across the ocean floor. His presence was overwhelming, a force as old as the ocean itself. And in that moment, Kylon and Lyra knew. They were standing before the ruler of the sea, the one who could restore the balance. At last, in the heart of the ocean's depths, Kylon and Lyra found him, the king of the Kauri snails. His shell glistened like a thousand pearls, and his eyes, ancient and wise, gazed upon them. He had waited for this moment, for two brave souls to restore the balance between land and sea. The king spoke of forgotten promises between the island and the ocean, a sacred bond that had been broken. He had withdrawn to protect the ocean's secrets, but now, Kylan and Lyra had proven themselves worthy to restore the harmony. As a reward for their courage and pure hearts, the King of the Kauri Snails restored the island's protection. The seas calmed, and the island's natural beauty was renewed. Kylan and Lyra had saved their home. With the King's blessing, Kylan and Lyra returned to Kauri Island as heroes. The storm had passed and the island was more vibrant than ever. The Kauri snails had returned, bringing life and prosperity back to the shores. The legend of the king of the Kauri snails lived on, and so too did the bond between the islanders and the sea. Kylon and Lyra had restored not only the balance of nature, but also the spirit of their people. And so, the island flourished once more, a paradise protected by the wisdom of the sea, and two young heroes who dared to believe in the power of a legend. If you enjoyed this journey into the legend of Kauri Island, be sure to like, share, and subscribe for more adventures. Where will our next story take us? Join us to discover more hidden wonders of the world.